you asked that because I had no intention on writing a book last year. I've, I've written a number of novels. I had one that came out in August and I was you know, happy with that. But about 18 months ago, just watching these state houses, engaging in the attacks on democracy and the uh, legislating of extremism, I'm quite active on Twitter and I almost tweeted something about how they were behaving as laboratories of autocracy, playing off that line from Justice Brandeis. And I was about to press tweet and send it. And I thought, you know, that's bigger than a tweet. I, I Maybe I should write an op-ed about this because people need to know that the attack on democracy is largely happening institutionally at the state house level. That's where it's happening. While everyone else is focused on January 6th, my worry is it's that the real damage at the heart of democracy is at the state level. And so I, I started writing an op-ed, and before I knew it, I had a chapter. And then three months later, I had an entire book. So this was kind of out of the blue. Then I had a problem because I talked to a few publishers. They're like, oh, that's interesting, but it'll take us a year to get this out. I said, I don't have time. What is happening is happening right now. And if we don't all see it as immediately, it will continue to succeed, which is basically, as the book title says, State houses are the front line in the attack on democracy, and it is an attack on democracy. The heart of the attack on democracy